question about the table on the first page of the annual letter, which shows the relative performance of the S&P 500 index against Berkshire's book value. Um, this is an unfair apples to oranges presentation. An invest investor in the S&P 500 index can easily earn the returns shown for the S&P, but an investor in Berkshire will not earn the returns implied by the company's book values figure shown. Instead, he or she will earn returns over any given period that depend on the market's assessment thereof, that is, the price to book value ratio, and we've seen that go down in, last, in the last few years. A fair, fairer comparison would be against the annual percentage change in the book value per share of the S&P 500, with dividends included. Well, actually, you could make the calculation two different ways as alternatives to what we do. You could have the market value of the S&P, which is in there, with dividends added back, versus the market value of Berkshire. Berkshire would show up better on that table than it does in the table I present. In other words, our advantage over the S&P would be larger if calculated that way because we started at a discount from book value and we ended up at a premium. So it would bounce around during the years, but overall uh, our gain would be probably uh, at least, well, it'd be about, it'd be about 35 or so percent higher in aggregate over the time than the shown by the, by the uh, book value gain, which is a lot of dollars when you get make, make the calculation. You could also show the book value of the S&P uh, versus the book value of Berkshire, but that, that figure will be a wash pretty much because the, if you take the S&P's price to book value, if that maintains the ratio at the beginning to the same ratio at the end, it, it's a wash as to how that calculation comes out. So I, I think we could show, we could make a calculation that was more favorable to Berkshire. I don't think what the person suggests there would result in a calculation that's, that's less favorable to Berkshire. Long term, the stock value has tracked fairly well the book, the book value. But it's overperformed book value. Yes. For the whole that's time, and, uh, which is the point this, the question seems well, to be. Well, you've been criticized for making yourself look worse. Yeah. No. <laughs> it's all right. You can bear it. <laughs> I've done the other two, not but <laughs>